huge. Yeah, yeah. There's, there's like, there's tr it has tributaries. It's, it's like a, it's like a freaking like Hoover Dam status thing here, just with lava. Hoover and there's a cave Dam. behind it Hell. as well. <laughs> the Helva Dam. Helva Dam, nice. Like it. Uh, yep. This this cave is all over lava. I am. A little bit worried, and it's a good thing we stashed all of the stuff in there now. Quite literally, the floor is lava. The floor is lava! I didn't even do anything. That was pathetic. I'm hearing skeletons around and I'm freaking out. <laughs> I'm staying super close to the corners. You get into the lava, thank you. It looks like you've kind of been down here. What do you mean? Been down here and then turned around. There's, there's torches down there and... There was some EXP laying around that I kind of went, yep, yeah, someone's been here. Yeah, that was I me. I presume it's you. <laughs> oh, I really need to block off some of these lava sources. I just don't want to accidentally place something wrong and then have it all overflow. There. I think that'll about do it. Well, I do have one fire resistance potion on me. Ah. That'll, that'll be handy in a, in a pinch. Don't let's use it yet, but... Blocked one off successfully. I'm gonna grab some coal ore blocks. I've been walking past a bunch of redstone as well, but when I wanted to put some redstone in my design company building, I just didn't have any redstone ore. <laughs> I'd fortuned it all into redstone already, so... I'll probably grab a little bit of that while I'm here. I don't know why I grab so much redstone. I don't do anything with it. It's just, <laughs> I don't know. It's for the experience. That's what I always say. Like, you, I mean, <laughs> not kind of like the experience of mining redstone, but you, you get loads of XP from actually harvesting the block. I think of the overworld stuff. Maybe diamonds give you more, but diamonds you find in such low quantities, whereas redstone you find all over the place, and it helps you level up pretty fast. Yeah, that, I suppose you, that you as almost. Well. <laughs> You almost don't need mob farms if you've got a decent supply of redstone ore. You can just go through it. This is going to be a bit tricky, this one. What, the big the big waterfall? Well, lava yeah. fall, rather. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm not going to do anything with it because it's giving us a lot of lights so and not many mobs yeah, can spawn. Yeah, yeah. Like I was going to say, I'm kind of tempted to go up and do something about it and then I'm more tempted to just leave it as it is and girt around the outsides. Villager zombie. Got him. I'm not even going to try to cure him. <laughs> not in a cave. He'd just wander into lava anyway. <laughs> They're terrible for doing that. Some dangerous gold around here. Yeah, there's gold in them now walls. Danger money. No lapis, though. Oh, I've got a ton of it. Ah. Did you pick up your ender chest again? Uh, no, I left it at the crossroads. It's fine. I'll I'll go back to it. Now oh, we're gonna be rich. <laughs> if we're not already, we uh, we are now. Dash some more of this. They're probably not as rich as um, Skull because he just finds all the things. Gull's so charitable with his resources, though. He just gives it all away once he gets it. Ooh. Okay, the lag is not helping in this situation. Stop it. Yeah. Catch. <laughs> Yay. Some tasty gold. Tasty gold. Gold apparently is pretty tasty because we uh, <laughs> we make golden carrots and golden uh, apples. Surprised our skin's teeth aren't like broken. Yeah. Oh, there's a downy bit down here. A downy bit. Yep. Oh. We're pretty low as it is. We're on like twenty something. So you keep exploring that. I will clean up. I'll get a bit of redstone from around here. I think I saw some back here. Okay, just coal and then some water, that's it, but... Ah, boo. Boo. 
swear I saw some redstone here a moment ago. Maybe you got it. I got one bit of it, yeah. Yeah, that was probably the one. <laughs> I saw one block and kind of went, yeah, I can take that. <laughs> Page the redstone thief. <laughs> Yeah, this just goes, gets narrower and narrower. Never mind. Wait, mine around here just in case. Every now and then there's another cave. We're at the right sort of height for diamonds, but... Nah, just getting cobble. I always go at it with the, uh, the idea that there is diamonds behind every wall. So, no, no block is wasted mining because you can always find diamonds just a block away. It's probably why I have so much cobble now. That kind of sounds like a weird inspirational quote, it's like every wall is yeah, worth yeah. digging because there might be diamonds put, put behind that it. Over a picture of, put that over a picture of like stars in the night sky or a nebula or something. <laughs> One of those like motivational things. Or a tree. Yeah, in the a, wind. Tree, a tree in the wind. Behind every wall is a block of diamond. And it has to have like a swing set on it as well. Yeah. <laughs> and when you post it to Facebook, you have to be like, uh, like and share this, otherwise, like, uh, your friends will leave you and you'll be all alone. Yes, yes. Share this with 20 people or your family will die in the night. <laughs> that escalated quickly. Well, it's Facebook. <laughs> it's what ma the majority of <laughs> posts on Facebook are, from my experience. Yeah, there's this one going around at the moment that says um, something like, share this or your mum is gay. <laughs> but the power of Facebook posts, it can turn straight people gay. If yeah. you don't share it. Found another little cave down, but there's nothing at the end of it. Unless there's diamonds hiding behind the walls. Oh, there's redstone. I'll take that. That'll there's do. redstone behind the walls. Yes, that's probably more accurate than the diamond thing, to be honest. <laughs> like, there's, there's redstone behind every walls of a cave. Diamonds, not so much. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Just dropped in for a cup of tea. Have you got any scones? <laughs> I wish I had scones. Okay, now we're going to have to have to have the talk. The why, talk? Why do, you, why do you say scones? Um, I don't know. It's just the way I pronounce it. <laughs> yeah. See, I say scones because of the word gone, but some people say scone because of the word bone, and everyone who <laughs> tries to learn English just slowly starts banging their head against the wall. Why are none of the sounds consistent? Thud. Thud. Because we like to confuse foreign people. <laughs> Apparently. Yeah. Apparently we do. Oh my, this is where all the skeletons were. Oh, up there. Get out of here, spider. <laughs> the zombie tracking you. I got him. Zombie can get in line. Yeah. The thing about zombies, they tend to do that. Oh my goodness. Get out of here. You're trying so hard not to swear, I really appreciate that. She's like, oh my goodness me. There's kind of like another ravine behind the great big lava fall. That is really unfair because we're not going to be able to get past that unless we <laughs> use the splash potion and swim up it. It's good for oh, six minutes. Oh, it's a splash minutes. potion? Yeah. Ah, interesting. Right. I say we do that because okay, it's come fun down to for you. the episode. Yep. Where you at? 
Where um, even is the lava ravine? I think I'm heading towards it. Yeah, I am. Yeah, you cool. are. Right. So there's a ravine, you say, up there and behind it? Yeah. Like in between, How does that work? Um, see where the one bit comes out? It's kind of like so a sort little of bit behind it. Aim for the block in the middle? Yeah. Really? Yeah. <laughs> right, let's do it. Let's do it. We can bail if it looks like we're going to run out of fire resist. Yep. But go like swimming in lava is really slow, so... Even with depth strider. Go for it. Okay, six minutes. Let's do this. Yeah, let's do this. Uh, I'm going pretty quick. Yeah, oh. it's not too bad, actually. I guess because we're swimming up, it's not too much of a problem, but... Okay, I'm on a, I'm on a pedestal. <laughs> Never wanted to put myself on a pedestal, but... Here we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, that is cool. <laughs> I have, have to spend no the next, idea where uh, I am. <laughs> there is not much up here, to be frank, but... It was worth it. That's still it. pretty awesome. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> still awesome for the experience of swimming up a stream of lava. Like we're on fire and it's and not burning us. <laughs> yeah. That's awesome. Excellent use of the splash potion anyway. Oops. Well, that was pointless. Yeah, yeah, mining anything up here is not going to be worth it. Right, let's, uh, let's head back down. There's iron behind it. Oh, there we go. I'm out. I'm out. There's something strangely, like, paradoxical about using lava to catch your fall when you're drum jumping from a height. It's kind of like, let me jump into this other thing that will kill me instantly. But, uh, obviously with the right preparation, not so much. Could really do with the lava effect not being on my HUD, though. Okay, yeah. I'm good. I'm still on fire. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm still burning! Right, um, I haven't got a great deal more stuff, but I'm going to stash it now anyway. <laughs> it's not going away. <laughs> oh, it will, it will. Here, here, have a... Oh, it's gone. water. You, you, were, you were probably going to uh, burn out in a minute anyway, but I figure water will help. So yeah, that was pretty good. Yeah. Four minutes of fire resist left. Let's go for a swim somewhere. Well, this is uh, something I'm going to add to the um, add to the what you call it museum in Freehaven. Oh, nice, nice. <laughs> you brought it over with you. Yeah, mouldy potato that I just happened to have in my pocket. Yeah, for, just in your pocket from when you were last in Castine. Right, we could explore any of the other offshoots of this cave right now. Because that was just one part of it. Like, I don't know how far you've been down this way. Pretty far. But there you've wasn't too done much. Done a little bit. Yeah, I'm still going to grab the iron and stuff from the walls because we haven't got a very big iron farm on the server yet. So, probably worth getting a little bit of this stuff. Didn't go over All these this little way. offshoots. A couple of blocks of coal, but nothing much else. Coal's Need to find some more useful. stuff that goes. It is, it's true, it is. I'm getting a little bit of experience from it as well, which is nice. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll find some place that goes downwards. And see what else we can follow. Surprise there's been no spawner in here. Yeah, you'd expect to find a dungeon in a cave this size. There's probably one around somewhere, but it's just not, uh, not in connected. the range we've yeah. travelled. Yeah. <laughs> All the cobblestone around here is stuff we've placed ourselves. Yep. And over here's the little fern. I'm following the trail of particles. <laughs> you still got your potion particles on. That's neat. Oh, and that's you where you got well. the diamonds, presumably. Yeah. yeah. Hi, fern. If I had some bone meal with me, I'd grow it. <laughs> so just this giant fern in the middle of the cave. I've got some. Do some bone meal. I... Anything around here, though? Nothing around there? No. How much fire resist have I got left? <laughs> 
Probably about a minute and a half if you've got the same as me. Uh, it says 25 seconds on mine. Oh, really? How? I don't know. Did you not get as much of the splash? Maybe you threw it more at me than at you. That sounds like something I'd do. <laughs> protecting other people before protecting yourself. Yes. You're uh, the altruist. Let's see what else we got. That's one way I'm to describe me, yes. <laughs> the way I'd prefer. I'm going to take a quick look down here. This lava stream is going. Oh, that's kind of leading back to where we were just then. Oh, <laughs> hopping around the lava. I still don't feel safe, even if I've got fire resist for a while. I still don't feel entirely safe. Yeah, it's like, especially and when you've got like fire resistance armor on as well, it's just like, I still don't feel safe at all. Yeah, yeah, just not protected. That being said, it's really fun and creative well, just to go swimming in lava because you don't burn. Yeah, yeah, just kind of run through it. I still have that picture of Kane and Ovi when we were um, on the server just in creative looking for places to found Freehaven and him and Ovi just sat in the... Uh, like the lava lake that's in the middle of the ice plains biome. Like it was a hot springs jacuzzi kind of place in the middle of uh, all this lava and stuff. And they're just on fire and they look like they're really enjoying themselves. <laughs> I think the best thing to do is going to go back to the cave entrance and then take another one of the passages that led off of there. Because yeah. there were a bunch of different ways we could go from there. So Did you go into here's the our next ravine? challenge. Yeah. Yeah, find our way out. Whoa. A lot of dark space over here, though. How'd you manage that? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I placed a block and jumped over. All good. Seeing as I was uh, graceful as an eagle piloting a blimp, I will just make my way over <laughs> slowly. Love that game. I really want to do the co-op stuff soon. I still haven't got together with Kane to do that, but we might do it on the next 24-hour um, stream. Aha, I found a dark bit over here with some emeralds in that you've not been in. Oh, -ho. <laughs> nice work. Et voilà, monsieur. Ah, merci. I'm hearing zombie. Around here. I can hear water. And lava. Now I hear zombie. 